What's going on, y'all? It's your boy Phil back on another video. And today, hold up, before we get into that, can you like, comment, subscribe? Help your boy out. Just trying to get as many followers as I can. Subscribers, not followers. I don't call people following. They just subscribe to, you know, the channel. If you like sneakers, content's free. I charge you nothing. Now, the shoe I'm getting in today, as you can see, Good old Puma pair. I have these. I haven't had these for years. I have not worn them yet. I got a shirt I think matches it. This shoe might be a little too loud for y'all. But here we go. And this shoe was called, I think it's called the Clyde. Yeah. So it's the Clyde Court. And this is the summertime colorway. Look how loud that shoe is. This is a loud shoe. But I like it though, it's different. It's different. Now, we're gonna start off with the right shoe. Off top, it already came with extra laces, the blue laces. I really like this shoe. Anyway, you got your black sole, White midsole, you got your checkerboard green and black all the way around the toe. You got your black Puma uh, sign, green laces, shoelaces. You got a blue tongue. Then the back, you got the pink with the black Puma sign. But on a pull tab on the back, it says 1973. Like, I just like the detail of that. Like I always said about the blue laces, the inside, it just got Puma in, in, in it. I like these two because of like you can really get your foot in them and you probably be really secure with the two pull tabs. Pull tabs and the pull more on the front of the shoe. And also on the back, uh, on the sole, it got Clyde written. I don't know if the camera picking that up. That was the right shoe. This is the left shoe. I just like the detail they put in this shoe. This is a big shoe too, because I think this shoe, this is size 12. I know this is size 12. I remember getting these. Yep, size 12. It was a different shoe. Now I'm looking at the shirt I got. It do match it, but it's probably going to be a lot. It's like a Venom shirt from Marvel, and it got black, pink, and green in it. I'm going to wear it. Oh, well, the detail of the shoe is ridiculous. Again, 1973 on the back with the Puma, Clyde written on the back sole. With the pink, I like the fact they just threw the pink on the back. That's fire. Yeah, the inside is the same thing. Like, that's fire. And this shoe was a hefty shoe. This shoe might be, um, yeah, I, I, I like this shoe. I like this shoe because, like, I'm a most likely wear these, like, with joggers. Yeah, I like this. And to be honest with you, I might not even change my shoestring. I might more me. I might have a mismatched shoestring because, you know, us as sneakerheads, we probably got a lot of shoelaces laying around. I mean, a lot. Like I, like I told you I, at my last video, I be shopping for my kids too, especially my daughter. And I shop so much. I saw something that I would want, but I'm like, oh, I might look at it as a clown for getting it, or I might look as being a clown for having it. So I got it for her. And it was shoelaces that glow up in the dark, like. I don't know what the fascination about things that glow up in the dark, but I just thought that was funny. Thought it was cute. I still might get them because I don't really care because I got shoes that glow in the dark and I can just put them in with them. But I got them for her. I don't know if she uses them or not. Like, I like having shoes that have like accessories. Like I have, I like having shoe accessories. But I got these shoe strings, right? I don't see them, bro. Did I move them? Oh, I didn't know this fell. My she hawk. Come on down. Um, I don't see them. I had some like shoelaces, but they were like different. They're like the shoelaces you plug in, so it's no like you don't have the time. But anyway, these class seventy three. I'm gonna be honest with you. This probably be the only pair I get because I'm so out of there. That's not the only Pumas I have though. I got the regular Clyde low ones. 
Yeah. You know what I'm also thinking? I'm thinking about getting some Converse with the Chuck Taylors. Just to have them, because it's a classic shoe. Because back in my uh, high school days, me and my cousin, I told you she like my sister, we had summer jobs, and we we wore Converse's. I remember having at least five pairs of them. I had the blue, the light blue ones, the navy blue ones. I had black ones, of course. I had the red ones, like, and they were cheap, and they're still cheap to this day. So, like, like I said, if you're a person, especially have like a decent size shoe, it's it's hard for me to want to get them because they're gonna look so long on my feet. They don't look like bolts. But I probably just want to get them just to have them, because I got some Stan Smiths, the these Stan Smiths, and they look long like bolts. And I don't know if I'm ever wearing them. I mean, I probably will if, like, to an event, but it's kind of hard. But anyway, I'm your boy, Phil. That's what I got for y'all today, the Puma Clydes. They don't even cost that much. It's multiple colors. Get you a pair. I'll highlight y'all next video. Like, comment, subscribe. And again, haters gonna hate. Need to bring that back.